Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel YouTube. This video is about the microwave and this one has a problem, it's not, uh, has no heat. It works, but no heat. And I can show you, this is just uh, cold water. And, uh, as you hear, this uh, it's like, uh, it's not normal noise. And it could be, um, I'm not sure what's wrong, but uh, soon we'll find out. So just to um, show you, um, you know, I need to turn out sometimes. Okay. And it's still very cold. So we'll find out what's wrong with this one. First, what we need to do is to unplug the power. This unplugged completely from the power and uh, to open the cover. Open the cover uh, simply by oh, maybe it's uh, goes in here too. You need to pull, and it comes out like that. So basically this is all uh, the component, uh, it could be uh, something wrong with any of those ones, but first we're going to diagnose uh, one by one. So first of all, what we need to do before we do anything, we need to um, release the voltage in here. And this is very dangerous, so you need to um, leak any, and also you can use this pliers here. You need the pliers with a plastic cover like this one or uh, like this one and we need to release any voltage in here we can hold it for about a few seconds to make sure no voltage left in here Yeah, please, you need to be very careful when you work in a microwave because it has a lot of very dangerous uh, high voltage and current and also impair. So just to make sure uh, you kind of leak any voltage in this here just to be safe before you do anything. So we're going to be testing this diode and uh, this is the main high voltage diode here. And we'll see how this will perform. So you see this is the, uh, that's the main fuse also, and uh, we're going to test that one, just to make sure it's working. So there's nothing wrong with this fuse. Put it back again.
This is a high voltage microwave uh, diode. I, I was just gonna test it to make sure this one is still working or not. And uh, so I grabbed, uh, I brought to those uh, two batteries, any one, any battery should work. And this one, it's uh, one point, uh, let's see, yeah, one, yeah, about 1.58 something volt. This one, it is nine volt, but because it's been used, so it's about, let's see, how much is it? About four volt, I would say about four volt or so. Okay, and uh, so to test the, the this one, I'm just gonna do any end, put it here first, grab this one, and let's do this one first, this test. Right now, 3.4. I'm just gonna flip it upside, turn the opposite, negative to opposite to and vice versa. So this diode is not good any, any anymore because it should test either one direction. It gives me a reading. When I flip it also, it's not supposed to read anything. So diode should read only in one direction. And that tells me this diode is not good anymore. Diodes always should read in one direction only, either this way or this way. So that's how you test uh, diode, high voltage diode. So, um, so far um, I found out what was the cause. The microwave, no heat. It's just because of this, unfortunately I looked uh, in uh, other uh, parts, different different parts, I could not find a similar one because this has a number here, uh, RG R6912, RG9612. Yeah. So that's the number here, RG. I'm gonna order the uh, same one like this one and uh, as soon as I get it, I'll put it back and test the microwave. But this is 100% causing the microwave it has no heat. So uh, for now, I'll just put it back. I know it's the number, so I'm just gonna order. Hopefully it's not gonna take long. And uh, as soon as I get it, I'll put it back and have it tested again. But uh, for now, I hope this video is helpful for you. If so, uh, please do not forget to uh, like and share, subscribe, check out other videos. All the best and hope to see you next uh, video.